This is the MLB pregame show, and I'm Matt Vaskersian. And as we draw nearer to the first pitch of game one in the series, we'll give you the latest installment of our Tops Player Spotlight. Big Daddy Slugger is our man to watch. And he had the long ball working in his last game. Three home runs really carrying his team on his back. Yeah, we see it maybe a couple times a year, but when a guy gets three homers in a game, it's always worth talking about. He got some good pitches to hit, and he just flat out did not miss them. I mean, I've seen guys put fewer out in a home run derby round, so he's clearly got plenty of power in that swing of his. And who knows, maybe he'll put on another show in this one. I wouldn't put it past him. Okay, Eric, Steve, and I are ready for baseball, and we'll have it for you next on the show. MLB The Show's in the heart of Texas on a Wednesday night at Minute Maid Park. Tonight, the first of two in this interleague matchup between the L.A. Dodgers and the Houston Astros. It'll be fun watching these two swing it all series long. First pitch is next. Time now to check out the lineup for the visiting Dodgers. Who's the one to watch, E.K.? Well, I think the focus has to be on the man hitting third. He's coming off one of the biggest performances of his career. A three home run game. Maybe there's no such thing as a hat trick in baseball, but that's as close as you can get. Colin McHugh is on the mound for Houston in this one. What do you have for us on him, E.K.? Well, guys, he's having a real consistent year. He's got an ERA under three. Anytime you're doing something like that, you're doing just fine. Hey, you're Big Daddy ready, Slugger will stride in, hoping to stay hot as he came Big through Daddy with a four-hit contest yesterday afternoon. Well, you know, he's been averaging at least an RBI per game over his last 10, so yesterday's performance shouldn't have come as any big surprise to anybody. Ground ball to second. This could be two. To he second down. for one. And oh. a bit of a high throw that time, but not much problem. Big Daddy Slugger will get a shot here in a bases loaded situation and you'd have to say they've got the right man for the job up here. Yeah, team leader in RBIs. He's got a shot to push that lead out even further if he could come through here. Hey, get your pitch right now. Uh, work it ahead. High in the air, it, carrying it, well it, it, out it, to deep it. center. Blanco going back. Gone! It's a grand slam. So he promptly unloads the bases with that one. 32 now for the season. And it's suddenly a 5-1 ball game. Well, he painted himself into an almost impossible situation on the mound. The conditions were ripe, and you know, when you're facing a guy like this with the bases loaded, you just get that feeling. Big Daddy Slugger is set to take some more swings. He homered back in the third inning. From the stretch, here's the pitch. He's running towards second. Hit pretty well out to deep left field. And he will not make the play. It's off his glove. Around third and being waved on home. And the run will score all the way from first. It's now 7-1. to one. So now time will be called as we're going to get a visit from the pitching coach here as he'll hope to settle his guy down. Kike Hernandez will try it again. He's grounded out and struck out in two trips. Yep, not showing too much so far, but he's got a chance to make something happen right here. See if he can put those other ABs behind him. A oh, one pitch on its way. Bounce to first. Well, run it, run it, run it, run and it. And he'll it. step oh. on the bag himself, and the inning is over. So it's two runs on two hits, no errors, and a runner left. On now to the bottom half of inning number four. It's the Dodgers seven. And the Astros won. Big Daddy 
Slugger will stand in here again, and as he does, it's a good time to flash you back to the third inning of the ball game as you take a look at his grand slam. Obviously, a key blow early on. Hey, you pitch. Drive it deep, huh? Here you go. Swing and a liner. Foul. Let fly. Let's go right here. A shot down the first baseline. A dive and oh, he can't hang on. And by the time he recovers, they'll have no play on him at first. It's an infield single. Center fielder, Kike Hernandez. Kike Hernandez will stand in, and they've been able to hold him in check so far. 0 for 3 to this point. Yeah, it's kind of surprising that he's been hey, a non-factor in this right one. one Usually out. a major force in their offense. Hey, let her fly, let her fly. Hey, one pitch right here. On out. Eight runs, nine hits. One error in the ballgame for the Dodgers to this point. Hey, one pitch. Make it yours. Now a swing and a ball hit in the air down the left field line. Rasmus has a read on it, and the inning is over. One left for L.A. Score remains even at eight apiece. Preston Tucker will dig in again. He singled home a run his last time. And they take another single hey, right here, too, no play. doubt. Runner in scoring position, so any ball into the outfield probably gets him home. Hot shot to third. Slugger is right there. Throw not in time, and he beats it out for his third hit tonight. Hey, drive that pitch. Big Daddy oh, Slugger is set to take some more swings. He homered back in the third inning. Third baseman, number 13. Hey, wait for yours here. Lying toward the gap in left center. And that's another base hit for him. He's on a tear in this one. And you check this out. This is on the inside part of the plate, but he still is able to take it to the opposite field. I'll tell you, that is back control at its finest right there. Kike Hernandez will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Runners on the move for second. Taken for strike three, the throw. And no throw as he'll just hang on to it. Yeah, he'll take second base here, but I think they were pretty well conceding that to him. So we'll have to see if he gets that score to stolen base or, or simply defensive indifference. Adrian Gonzalez strides in, grounded out his last time through. Two out here and a runner at second. hammers it to deep right field back goes Springer makes the catch and that's the ball game and you know this is one celebration that I didn't think we were going to be seeing they came from way way down and turned this thing around that just shows you how you can't take any lead for granted in this game Plenty of offense here in this one as we give you one final look at the line score. Well, a pretty good offensive show of force in this one. Probably at least a couple of players deserving. But, gentlemen, let's go ahead and give this man the nod as our top player of the game. Yeah, he connected on a couple of long home runs. Really put his guys on his back and carried them to the victory. 
So that's a wrap here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Eric Karros and Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click on over to theshownation.com. The Astros win this thing 14-8. Good night from Houston. Time of the ball game, three hours and 57 minutes. Tonight's paid attendance at Minute Maid Park, 40,950. The Astros, thank you for attending.